This will not hurt. Oh, no. Whoop. Wait, this will hurt. It's going to hurt. Okay, maybe this won't hurt, okay? Let's see if I can do it. Oh, the power. The power, the power. Voila. This one's going to go here. Probably like so. I know, I thought that it would go, yeah. It's got to be able to connect up here though because it's too heavy. That's what I was going to say, yeah. yeah. So it's going to, like on this side, it's, it's You know, even if you had a, uh, the lid of a can. That's her. Uh, the lid of a can and put something through it, like a, uh, I don't know, even a metal straw or something. And it went under here and came out. And this could stick on it and it would hold it up. Oh. I had to do so a... like a metal can and... The, or he, yeah, just, you know, like a big metal can lid. And put something through it that's going to stay. Right? And put that, put, the, put it through here and then get this on there. Now, it's not going to hold it up like that. Okay, okay, it's, I see what you It's still going to hang, yeah. Because okay. I had, I did a play once where a guy, I'm off stage and a guy shoots an arrow off stage. I had to quickly take off my shirt, put a, like a patrol boy, and I had a tin can with a nut soldered to it. All I had to do was screw the, through, through the shirt, screw the arrow on, and I could do whatever I wanted. That arrow was going right. to... Right, nice. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, because it's not going to stay down there unless you make it come down there. Yeah, we just, it was last minute. Was yeah, yeah. Thank you, I appreciate that. Well, that's the problem with being an artist. You're, you can work on it forever, but there's a deadline. Yeah. <laughs> Now you got to be on camera. What are you going to do? Yeah. This guy's great. That's great. Vision's obscure. How are you? I'm good. Hello. Yeah. Hello. All right. Hello. Oh, you're Yeah. That's right. I'm on deck. Here we go. I dare the three of you to go to McDonald's when this is over. <laughs> Actually, Tom, I wanted to show you something. I just made that too long ago. Okay. I was loving it. Oh wow. What you would think I could also do better on my own sculpture. Wow, it's heavy. It was a very, very big no, mold, I would say that. Yeah, that was a big one. Well the only thing I could think of I mean unless there's some reason why it didn't need to be heavy. Because right now it's fine, you know. But hollow would be fine. Yeah. You know, hollow. That's pretty cool. Is it shouldn't this be silver? Uh, it's, it's it's like a dark with a uh, with a good light okay. green on it. But... <laughs> I have one of these in my game room. Oh, really? A dead fairy, yes. your eyebrows like almost the top of your head mm -hmm. it's kind of a Frankenstein top of your head yes. yeah and what's your problem <laughs> you you look like an art deco monster here <laughs> all these squiggles yeah this is beautiful this is her work oh really yes ah, that's great. I did the voodoo doll that was in there with the stitches and stuff it's very clean the edges are like, there, there aren't any. Mm -hmm. No, it's really beautiful. I'm gonna take a picture of it myself. Oh, yeah, thank you yeah. so much. Two, 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 okay. Whoop. Mm -hmm. All right, look better. That's great. I love, this is all. Did you, what did you use in this as an example for all that? Um, I was, um, very heavily influenced by like Renaissance art and um, kind of like the gargoyle look, but I wanted it to be very demon esque. But I well, you did it. You got both. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. And your hair is perfect for this too. Yeah. yeah. How did you get the color so dense? I mean, even on your neck where it's where it's not latex. I did um, a lot of dark, the darker maroon red, and then I did the lighter. Oh, red. Oh, yeah. 
that's a good idea. That's perfect. You know what most people forget when they're doing an appliance on somebody? It should be blood red, and then you put the flesh color over it. Because then, if not, it looks gray on camera. Did you ever see that? Yes. Like even Spock's ears in Star Trek sometimes. Unless, not the new Star Trek, but because they know enough to paint them red first. Mm -hmm. But that's a great idea. Yeah. Hi, what's up? <laughs> so I said rabbit, but it's a moth. Yes, moth. I get it now, I get it. <laughs> it's Mothman. <laughs> Mothman, okay. Cool, let me see that. Okay. It's a mask. And uh, these? Those are uh, poly-filled animals. So I cast these them just with feathers. plastic and I filled them with poly so Wow. very light. And the eyes? Yep, I painted those. Yep. Look at the hands. Too. You could hurt somebody with them. <laughs>